Hey guys, what's up? Apple App Store 101 here. Today we're doing a quick review of the Shield skins for the iPhone 3G and 3GS. But before we get into this video, I'd like to thank Shield Skins for sending me out this product to review and give away. So thank you, Shield Skins. It's really appreciated. Guys, definitely go check out their website. I'll have a link over in the video description. So without further ado, let's get right on. So here are the Shield Skins, guys. In the package, you do get the front and back skin. Um, if you guys do not want the front and back, it does come with the screen protector only or the back protector only. Um, the entire kit is $14.99 over at their website. The uh, front or the back is only $7.99 over at their website. Guys, once again, go check out their website. It's www.shieldskins.com. I'll have a link over there. Um, so anyway, um, yeah, you get the skins in the package. You get the directions. You get the application solution, the little bottle of liquid. Um, and then you got the squeegee so that's all that comes in the package and installing it's pretty easy here i have my iphone 3gs i have the shield skins installed on here it doesn't really look like i have anything on here but there is a really thin layer of film on here and that is the shield skins so putting it on is relatively easy all you really need to do is spray your fingertips with the application solution pick the layer of film off the sticker sheet, spray that with solution, and then put it on the back of your phone, um, and uh, line it up wherever you want it. I have lined it up really good. Here's my camera hole. There's no film around the chrome or anything, so I, film, I uh, put it on very well. Anyway, um, the front is pretty much the same thing all you really need to do is spray your fingertips peel it off the sticker sheet spray the solution on the film place it and then squeegee out any bubbles anything that you got um, and then let it dry uh, you have to let it dry for about an hour I did to, until the sides actually stick down um, so yeah installation is overall pretty easy um, another thing is the application solution that they include the bottle is much too small guys um i've had an invisible shield and they include a bottle of solution that is two and a half times bigger than that hold on let me see if i can actually find that um i'll be right back with that bottle of solution okay guys we're back and here is the bottle of solution that zag includes it is about two and a half times bigger as you can see so that's that and that's that this is really like thin and this is thick and long so um the application solution needs to be bigger about this size um so that's a flaw that i found i didn't have enough solution while i was installing mine um i had about like that much left and i had to put a little water in so i could actually install it but uh anyway overall i really like this product it's really durable actually shield skin sent me out some scrap material and I've tested it um, I've even cut it with a knife and this is a sharp knife um, anyway I'm gonna uninstall the uh, shield skins in this video see if there's any residue left all you really need to do is peel it off I think um, just like a zag let's see Okay, let's see if it leaves any residue or anything like that. Okay, this may take a second. It's really tugging on it hard. This was adhered to the phone very well. I'm pretty happy with this stuff. So there we go. It's off the phone. And there we have it. Um, I'm going to show you guys how strong this stuff actually is in a second. Um, so here I have a knife. I'm just going to go across it really soft. And it's not cutting. But look at this right here. Hold on. Let me get a uh, sticky note to show you how... Um, sharp this knife is there you go that's how sharp it is just cuts right through it but this stuff 
is durable. All right. Okay, so just cut it, but I was putting some good pressure on that, and that just shows how good this stuff really is. All right, now let me just take off the screen protector part. Oh, there it goes. That came off a little easier. Um, so here's that, and let's try to cut this again. Okay, let me actually like put it down in there. See how durable this is, guys. There we go. I actually really had to pull hard on that. You guys saw how hard I was tugging. Um, but yeah, that is really the review of the shield skins. Guys, go check this stuff out. I really liked it. And uh, I, the only reason I really took it off is for the review. And um, I have to review some other cases and such. But, oh yeah, guys, it does have a little residue on it. But you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get some eye clear and spray it off and then see what happens. Guys, also, Shieldskin sent me out this really nice microfiber cloth. And um, it's not actually available on their website. But this is one of the best microfibers I've ever used. So that's great. So after wiping it down a little bit. I don't feel any stickiness or anything. So that's about it for this review, guys. Hope you all enjoyed. I actually do have a giveaway for the shield skins going on right now. I'll have a link to that video over in the video description. Um, and that's about it. Peace.